Welcome to God's Own TV. Almighty God, we grant your request. Pastor Enoch Adeboye, lead pastor of the Redeemed Christian Church of God, RCCG Worldwide, revealed what happened to him after God gave him a private jet. The cleric, who is well-respected and honored around the world, recalled that the brand-new U.S. registered jet he acquired in 2015 caused an uproar, especially on social media, where some Nigerians accused him of joining the long list of pastors who they believed exploited their members for personal gain. According to reports, the tongue wagging of some Nigerians led to the unexpected EFCC investigation on the man of God and his ministry. After disclosing the investigation on him by the EFCC in the first Holy Ghost service in 2023, the cleric established the fact that the purpose of acquiring the jet was not for pleasure but to aid his movements to international countries in doing God's work, as commercial aircraft did not have the level of effectiveness he needed. In his words, I did not acquire the jet for pleasure but for God's work. I travel around the world very often and there was no way I could effectively be at these places with commercial aircraft. He went further to give an example of his busy schedule, saying, One day I finished a conference in Europe attended by people from 33 nations. Immediately after the conference, I flew to Hong Kong, finished my mission there, moved to Singapore, finished my program there, moved to Australia, from there to Papua, New Guinea. And I needed to visit these places and be back for the next Holy Ghost service in Nigeria. Although the wide amount of criticism got the man of God worried according to him. But after inquiring from God, he knew God backed him up after this, he replied him with an unusual cyclic shape of rainbow. The cleric went further to address Nigerians on the matter of men of God prophesying on who the next president in the 2023 election in Nigeria would be. In his words, so-called prophets who have been prophesying on who will win the election should stop deceiving the people. He stressed that the prophets were fake and they were not prophesying but only doing guesswork. He added that Nigerians should get their PVC and vote as the Spirit led them, as God is yet to speak on the election. 